Привет! It's only PvP Cat, and in this video I'm gonna tell you about hip fire. This little trick that can let you win many, many fights in Red Dead Online, especially in modes like name your weapon or stuff like this. I'm gonna make some tests that will show you how strong hip fire in this game and why is it strong. And also give you some tips and tricks about when it's better to use hip fire or when it's better to use regular AI. To perform a hip fire, you just press in fire button without pressing aim button, and then you're gonna shoot just like this. Hip fire also has this little auto aim that will help you to hit your target. And now you can see me testing this auto aim for different situations. And here are my conclusion. First, range of this auto aim and here i was impressed i knew that it's big but it's actually huge <gasps> that's what she said <laughs> for example for shotgun it will help you to hit your target and use auto aim with a hip fire from 25 steps and that's pretty impressive now you can see me testing shotgun on 30 steps and it don't auto aim but revolver does so this hip fire auto aim range i hope it's not too complicated is different for most weapons is one for shotguns it's bigger for revolvers and of course it's the biggest for rifles and repeaters just like regular auto aim range and you can see me hip firing my target with a little bit but still out aim from pretty solid distance with a bolt action rifle and of course sniper rifle don't have this out aim when using hip fire but you can hip fire with sniper rifle if you want to and now as you can see i reached this out aim range for hip fire when using rifles and it's it's pretty solid but you know what's even more impressive it's another test that i made for hip fire in this test i'm gonna check and compare fire rate when we're aiming and when we're using hip fire so first we're gonna try mauser pistol and it makes 10 shots in 5.2 seconds when aiming and now with a hip fire it fires so much faster it's only 4.5 seconds much faster but you know what let's check different weapons uh, for example bolt action rifle and take a note that we are testing it without counting time that we actually need to make this initial aiming and it took 5.9 seconds to make five shots and as you can see hip fire is so much faster 4.2 seconds it's 30 percent faster and we're not even counting time that it takes to aim that's why hip fire is so powerful and before we continue with even more interesting results i must remind you that each time when you making a kill with a hip fire you get extra 10 experience point and also i have to remind you that if you like the video place a like you know how it works right okay now let's test revolver simple Caitlinman. 2.3 seconds to make six shots when aiming and now get ready 1.1 second to make six shots with a hip fire it's insane let's check the slowest revolver of all it's a lemma revolver so we are making six shots it took 3.6 seconds now we are reloading for like half an hour and we are ready to test it with a hip fire <laughs> just look at this 1.4 seconds for six shots with a lemma revolver slower weapon in the wild west now let's make another test and see the fire rate for dual wield revolvers and i'm using katelman revolvers again it took 3.9 seconds to make this 12 shots and now i'm gonna make the same test but using hip fire and you can see it's faster it's more than one second difference and you know what i actually made the video about hip fire for my russian language channel like half a year ago and there i was just saying how 
hip fire is an interesting tool to add to your pvp experience but now when i made this test i'm impressed it's not only that hip fire auto aim range is insane it's also you really firing your weapon so much faster the difference is not because you're not wasting time to make an aim as i thought previously but also because you just fire like a machine gun or something like this so if you are not using hip fire you are just wasting a lot of potential advantage as well as if you are not subscribed to this channel you also wasting a lot of potential advantage Anyway, let's talk about tips and tricks <laughs> that I can give you about when it's better to use hip fire. And I'm not gonna waste your time with obvious tips like use hip fire when your enemy suddenly runs out around the corner and you are in a close distance. To be honest, the only real advice I can give you to improve your hip fire technique is to practice. Yes, just try to use hip fire when you can and that's how you gonna figure out this optimal range when you can use hip fire and if you are far from your target then this range you shouldn't use it that sounds pretty easy but you know what only with experience you will learn how to use hip fire properly and please don't think that hip fire is only a thing in a name your weapon game mode it can be useful in many different situations in most wanted and other game modes you can try it with semi-auto shotgun with double lemas or with leechfield repeater using express ammo and ministry try it and if you haven't used this hip fire technique previously you will be surprised about how effective it is i can guarantee you this and if it's your case then please come back to this video and write a comment about your opinion on this hip fire technique anyway guys write a comments please and thank you for your attention i was really surprised by results of these testings and i hope that you you enjoyed it too. So see you next time, goodbye.